amazing is this? I am honestly so excited to use this. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Katie. Sorry I've been missing for the last two weeks with my new job starting and everything. I've been trying to get into a new routine. It's finally half term, so I am just able to sit down and film this video. But I'm so excited about this video. If you know me well, you know that I absolutely love planners, stationery, highlighters, anything on those lines. And a company reached out to me called the Christian Daily Planner and asked me if I would like to be gifted one of their planners. So of course I was like, absolutely so they have sent me their christian daily planner i've went for it in black but it also comes in white but i just thought if i get the white it won't last two minutes and it'll have finger marks and chocolate and who knows what else all over it off my kids so i've gone for the black so it comes in this really nice box so i just thought i would do a little review because i have to share this planner with you it's just so gorgeous so it has this embossed Christian daily planner and it has this open Bible with the cross coming out of it. You also get this elastic so it keeps everything together, which I really like. And then it also comes with a pen, which is just one of these little twisty pens. Let's see what colour ink this is. Okay, it is black ink. So we like that. I used to only like using blue pen when I was like at school and things. Now I'll only use black. This is the planner. It is quite thick because it is a yearly planner, but it's not particularly too heavy. I feel like this could go quite easily in my bag still. And then you also get in the box this Christian Daily Planner sticker. So it comes with this sheet, which is custom tabs, and they're all cut out already for you. So you can create your own tabs. Or it's got the months for you in black or white, or you could alternate, depending on what colour scheme you want to go for. And then just to put the cherry on top of this planner, a portion of your purchase goes to bringing clean water to those in need as well, which I just think is fantastic. So I will leave links to this planner in the description box if you want to go and purchase it for yourself. It does say you can receive 10% off if you join their mailing list so if you want to make a little save in there it's worthwhile doing that but let's have a look now inside this planner okay so i'll just take this flyleaf off you can see here how they have got the title on there and then inside the first page that you've got is just this planner belongs to your phone number your email and your address in case you lose it and then it has a page on how to actually use the planner and then it tells you everything else that is included in this planner. And then it just gives you this overview of everything that is inside and then it goes straight to your 2023 yearly calendar. So I like to use these calendars just to map out people's birthdays. So I just put a little highlighted dot over whenever it's someone's birthday. And then to go with that, it perfectly matches here with dates to remember. So where I've highlighted, I would just put whose birthday it is, or if there's anything important happening, like weddings or christenings or anything like that. And then it's got all of your holidays listed out here. And then here is what I found super exciting. So you can do a goal map for 2023. Now, if you know me, you know that I love a little bit of forward planning. I love to set goals at the end of each month for the next month coming up. So this is really exciting to me that I can do all of that in this planner. So here it says, to arrive at your destination, you must know where you're going. Make 2023 a great year by mapping it out. Reflect on last year's goals and achievements with the intent to add or improve upon these in the coming year. So you can review your year here and then you can set your goals here. And it just kind of gives you something to kind of work with. And then it goes straight into January. So I guess this is where you will put your tabs. And for each month, you have a review for the previous month and then your goals for the next month. <laughs> you know how excited I am for this. And then here it's also got a budget section. So you can do all of your financial budget in here, everything that you've got money to spend on, everything that you spent and what difference you had left at the end of the month, your savings, what you're given and your totals. I am so excited about this. And then it has this huge monthly spread on two pages where you can just plan out your whole month. Again, a section to write your goal. And the great thing about this being a Christian planner is it also has a space for prayer reminders, which is just amazing. So what would you focus your prayer on this month? So you can do focused prayers, which I've never thought about planning out my prayers, but that is amazing. Habit reminders, and then a section for notes. And then this is what the weekly spread looks like. So it's a spread across two pages and it's in vertical format. So you've got your personal goals at the top, 
spiritual goals at the bottom, a Bible verse in the middle, and then you've got your daily spread. So you can do time blocking here if you want to. You can make this a checklist and tick off things as you've done it, like a to-do list kind of section. It's got your habits or your focus for the day at the top here. What I would probably do here is write out anything important that's happening on the day, if there's any events, my work schedule, that kind of thing. And then down here, I would probably use this as my to-do list for the day and tick off what I've done. And then here, you've got a little section for your habit or your focus of the day. So this could be a word of the week that you want to focus on, or it could be just something that you know you want to get done that week. And then at the bottom here, you can also track your sleep as well. And it even has a section for weekly tasks. And at the bottom here, wins this week and things you want to improve on this week. I mean, I don't think this planet is lacking in anything. It has thought of everything you could possibly need and wait for the next page. So the next page, when you go to church, you can write down your service notes for the week. So you have a full year's worth of church notes from all of the sermons that you've gathered across the year. So every Sunday, you can write who your speaker was, what the message was called, the date at the top, and then what the message was. I mean, come on. And you can also write a little takeaway here from like what you've learned, what you're going to use and how you're going to apply that in the next week. And then here, it's got a prayer journal as well. So you can write out your prayers for the week. Is this not just the best planner you've ever seen? And that's what it looks like. It goes through all of the weeks of the year, exactly the same format. And then at the end, you have this two page spread which is a 2023 review. So you can write down everything that you've learned across that year. So if you're anything like me, you're probably thinking, this is amazing, I need this planner in my life. Wait for it, there's still more, there's still more. So that's your yearly kind of spread. And then at the very end, has a section for tracking all kinds of different things. So it has a Bible reading log. So it's got all of the Bible books listed out here. And then you can colour in as you read each Bible verse. So by the end of the year, if you want to, you can have read the whole Bible in a year. I'm so excited for this planner, guys. So this page is the Old Testament. And then on the next page, you've got the New Testament. And then you've got a contact section. So you can write all of your contacts in here. Seriously, you can, it keeps your whole life in this planner. And then it has a section on books that you would like to read. So you can record all of them down across the year, all of the books that you've read, all of the movies that you've watched. It's also got a password organizer. When I used to plan in my file faxes way back in the day, I used to have sections on all of these things. And I just love that this is all kept in this book. So you've got everything you could possibly need just in here. And it's got a grocery shopping list which you can put all of your regular things that you want to buy for the week. And then it's got a meal planner. And that goes across a few weeks worth of that. Let me just skip past them. So you get a few weeks worth of that. And then it also has a food and exercise tracker. <laughs> Honestly, I'm so excited about this. So here you write down across the week everything that you've had for breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, your water intake, your vitamins, and what you did for your exercise. Amazing. And it's got quite a lot of them, and these are also perforated, so if you want to, you can rip these off and put them on your fridge, which is probably what I would do to make sure that I keep doing it. If it's on the fridge, stuck on, it's like, okay, can't avoid that. Then it's got a holiday meal planner. So on here, you can write down all of your main dishes, preparation, your buy list, your side dishes, appetizers, drinks, desserts. You can plan it all out. And then if you're going on holiday, don't you worry, it's also got a travel checklist. So on here, it's got all the necessities, accessories, beauty, electronics, health, clothing, before you go, things you need to do, and a note at the bottom which says, pray for safety over your home and trip. So it's got a few pages of them again perforated so you can rip them out take them with you wherever you want them to go and then it also has a section called the gardening planner where you can plan out all of the different things that you would like to plant where you're going to plant it the needs that it has the date that you planted it and you can keep track of all of that <laughs> it literally covers everything and then right at the back it just has note pages again perforated so you can rip them out if you want to and you've got quite a few of those and finally the last thing is it has a pocket here where you can keep your cash envelopes if you do the envelope system you can keep receipts you can just keep recipe cards anything that you want in the back of this planner 
How amazing is this? I am honestly so excited to use this. So it starts in January 2023, so we've got plenty of time if you wanna go out and get one. This is what the white one looks like. It's beautiful, I would probably have chosen that one out of preference, but this one just makes more sense for the type of life that I have. Um, so I'm gonna sit now, I'm gonna put these tabs in and I'm gonna get everything ready for 2023. I'm so excited. So I hope you've enjoyed looking through this planner as much as I've enjoyed showing it. Thank you so much to the Christian Daily Planner for gifting me this. This is honestly one of the best gifts ever. I love anything to do with planning and things like that. And don't forget you can receive 10% off if you sign up to their mailing list. I will link their website down below in the description box. Thank you so much for watching. If you aren't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button and the like button and I will see you in my next video.